Hello, may God bless and protect you. Repeat with me the phrase. I can do everything through him who strengthens me. In this prayer, I want to ask you a question. That the Holy Spirit has placed in my heart. Have you been watching the people you allow to enter your home? Have you been watching the people you've been talking about your dreams, your projects? In today's prayer, I want to bring God's direction to you. It's a revelation from God for your life. I have the Holy Bible open here. And the Lord spoke my heart. Read on because I'll put the right people who need to hear this message. That's why I always say here on the Daily Prayer for You channel. That in the things of the Lord there are no coincidences. Look at the word that God told me to give you in this prayer. Written in the book of James, chapter 3, verse 16. For where you have envy and selfish ambition, there you find disorder and every evil practice. That's what I want to draw your attention to. Deliver the Lord's message to you in this prayer. Before I speak, I ask you to write in the comments below this video. Write your first name and phrase. Lord, deliver me from all envy. Know that all people who write sentences are declaring to God. It is also very important that you like this video. Because when you leave your like you tell YouTube that this prayer is doing you good. And that he can pass on to others who need to hear that same message. And you who are listening to the prayers of the Daily Prayer for You channel for the first time. Know that there is a purpose for you being here with us. God is seeing what you are not seeing. God has already seen things he doesn't like in certain areas of your life. Know you're here cause for sure. God saw that in some areas of your life. His life was overtaken by envy. And through this prayer all this envy will be blocked and expelled. We don't talk about religion here, you need to understand that. Here it is about God. At this moment I want to give you a very important direction. I invite you to subscribe to the channel. It is completely free and will be the best way for you to receive the next prayers. Here below this video there is a button with the word subscribe in red letters. I ask you to click this button. Soon after, click on the bell that will appear on the side. And at the end you should click on the word all, you click too. By doing this, every time I send new powerful prayers, you will receive for free through your YouTube application. From now on you will be in my daily prayers. Pay attention to what I'm going to tell you now. The Holy Bible says, For where you have envy and selfish ambition, there you find disorder and every evil practice. Don't leave here even to share now. Listen very carefully. There are many people that life was going very well. And when things start to go right in her life, I know that the person is very happy and wants to talk to other people. But you need to analyze who you talk to. With whom you share your achievements and your problems. Because where there is envy there is confusion. There are people that the love relationship was very well. And unfortunately because the person does not know the heart of the human being. Because only the one who knows the human heart is God. There are people who in front of you smile at you. But in her heart she envies you. And some people who, due to lack of knowledge, they share good times, good things that are happening. There are people who are about to do something, are close to buying something. A door is about to open and the person tells someone about it. The person ends up saying, if everything goes well, I'm going to start working, I'm going to do. And suddenly things start to go wrong, it starts to get difficult. It starts to go away and it doesn't happen. And the person says to himself, Oh my God, why is this going wrong? I'm praying, I have a prayer routine every day. Yes, but you need to remember two things the Lord Jesus said. Of a direction he gave. Watch and pray. You can be praying. But maybe it's not watching like it should. You understand? There are many people who start working. Start earning more money. 
are getting ready to buy a car, a house. They are not silent and there are people who cannot know. Cannot know any of your plans? Can't know what their next step is? You understand? Sometimes you open the door of your house because of lack of vigilance. For people who seem to be friends. Of course, not all people are like that. There are people who are true. There are people who really belong to God in our lives. You place a person in a place that is sacred. Your home is a holy place. Not everyone can enter your home. And I will give a very serious direction here. There are people who open the door to people. And commits one of the errors that spiritually speaking is very terrible. Let certain types of people into the couple's room. Let an envious person enter the couple's room. And then suddenly the person doesn't understand why there started to be confusion between the couple. The couple who were living happily start to fight suddenly. Begin to cool off in the relationship. You need to understand that there is a friend. There is a colleague and there is an acquaintance. And there are many people who do not know how to differentiate this. People who treat a colleague or acquaintance as if they were a friend. There are people who are co-workers. And your relationship with that person should stay at work only. And the person does not watch and puts the person inside his house. And then the house starts to have confusion. Today I am here in this prayer as a prophet of God for your life. To say to you. Watch over. It's no use for you to pray. If you're not watching. Situations that haven't happened in your life yet. You need to keep it to yourself, don't go around talking to others. But you might think. I'm so happy I wanted to tell others. This is exactly why things go wrong for some people. Because they don't wait, they don't watch. You need to be vigilant. Watch the people who enter your home. Watch who you share your plans with. That which has not happened yet, which you are preparing to happen. Learn something very important that I'm going to tell you. The secret protects your blessing. It's one thing to talk about it after it's already happened. As many people tell the testimonies, because in that case you already have the victory completed. And the door that God opens no one closes. Another thing is the situation that hasn't happened yet. And the person is already talking to someone else. Wait to happen. Wait for it to happen and then you talk. My prayer today will be that God will free you from all confusion of envy. That everything that may be happening in your life is bad because of envy. That through this prayer come to be blocked. Through this prayer all envy be expelled. Through this prayer, all this evil disappears from your life. Do you believe it? Do you get it? I want to pray for you now. And my prayer is that the Lord will eliminate any and all confusion. That can be in your life through envy. Let's pray. Almighty God. Beloved Father. In this prayer I want to ask the Lord for the lives of each of your sons and daughters who are with me now and everyone who is going to watch this prayer sometime during the day for the first time. God, I want to ask that the Lord come to touch and that all the confusion, any envy that may have attained spiritual life, sentimental life, financial life, family life, the health of your sons and daughters, that at that moment all envy is blocked and expelled. May the light of the Lord be upon this life at this moment. I declare to God that everyone who is receiving this prayer today also receive protection, deliverance, that all the houses now where I am my Father through this prayer, all the houses that I will enter today through this prayer be blessed by the blessing of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And may your light Lord be stronger than any darkness. God, as your son, I bless. The life of each person who is praying with me right now. May all be blessed, receive the light and protection of the Lord. Then say Amen and say Glory to God.
receive the protection of this prayer. God protect you from all envy. Before finishing this prayer, I have a very important message for you. I recommend that you write after finishing this prayer. That I recommend that you also listen to the powerful prayer of the 91st Psalm. She is a very strong prayer capable of bringing great blessings to you and your family. I'll leave the link in the first pinned comment for you to access. And I also want you to let God, the Holy Spirit use you. Share this prayer with as many people as you can. God will show you who you need to share this prayer for. Until our next powerful prayer here on the Daily Prayer for You channel. God protect you and bless you greatly.